This is CBS 12 News at 3. We'll still head on CBS 12 News at 3, honoring the life of Edna W. Runner. Next, we're joined live with the director of the Jupiter Center with how they're hoping her legacy lives on. In an ION community now, the Edna W. Runner Tutorial Center in Jupiter is honoring the life of Edna, who passed away in November. The center is hosting a celebration of history and future in her honor, and they want you to be a part of it. So here yes, to tell us more is the director of the center, Travis Conway. Thanks so much for being here this afternoon. Thank you for having me. Excited I'm, to be here. Yeah, I'm glad you got through all the traffic of all <laughs> the breaking you. news we had earlier. But what people want to know now, for those who are not familiar with the center, could you tell us what your mission is, what you guys do there? Yeah, so we're a nonprofit in, Ju in the Jupiter area. We take care of a lot of disabilities. Youth. We want to make sure that they get to as close as a great level as we can. So we partner up with the schools that we serve as well as the community and make sure that we can drive it and make sure they're doing what they're supposed to be doing. And we spoke about it a little bit earlier about how we lost Edna in November. Yeah. Was she so proud to see you take over the uh, director position? Yes, she was. I was actually a former student before uh, all of this. Uh, so I was a former student, uh, went to college. She told me to come work for her. And then 12 years later, here I am as the executive director. So I'm happy she did get to see me fall into the role that she led for so many years uh, at the center. So I'm happy to be there and, and help her legacy continue. And how has your experience, you know, shaped your trajectory in life? Yeah, my experience, my experience at the center honestly has molded me into who I am today. If it wasn't for me going to the center and being exposed to different places, I honestly would not be standing here next to you. I might be in jail somewhere. So I'm just proud to say I'm an alumni from the center as well as doing good in life as well, too. And you're now making an impact as the director yeah. yourself. <laughs> so speaking of making an impact, there mm -hmm. is an upcoming fundraiser. Yes, it's there called is. Dream Continue. Tell yes. me a little bit about that. So we're going to be honoring Ms. Runner's legacy as, as well as looking towards the future. So we're always looking for sponsors because we need some right now. Uh, but that night is really to make sure that we have some funds to come in to continue Ms. Runner's legacy, as I said, but also make sure that we have something there for the future. So we're looking for scholarship money, uh, continue to do the summer camps that we provide, the spring break, uh, the Christmas, everything that we do there. We just need the funds to continue it going. So that's what this event is for, and hopefully we can have some people from the community to come in and give us some fun so we can continue to do it. And so how do people get a hold of you guys? We do have a little bit more time to talk about yes, this. Yes, so uh, they else? can go on our website at ewrunnerctr.org and look up the sponsorships that's on there, as well as just call our organization 561-745-0950 and get more information from there. And just one more uh, testimony opportunity. If you mm -hmm. could just speak from your experience or maybe the kids that you see on a daily basis, just how much this impacts the community in a positive way. Absolutely. So I could tell you right now, as I said earlier, if it wasn't for the center, I would not be here today. But there's a plethora of alumni who's coming back. Even at the gala that we're having, uh, we're going to have a guest speaker there who was also a student as well when I was there. And they're going to be talking about how she became a lawyer. We're going to have alumni who's an executive director of a nonprofit here, alumni who are project managers. So the center means a lot, especially to the West Jupiter community. And that website, one more time for people who want questions or tickets? Yes, ewrunnerctr.org. All right. Well, you heard it from the director himself. Looking forward to seeing her legacy being honored. And uh, thank you so much for what you thank do for you. the community. Thanks thank for you. being here. We'll be right back.